let's throw this. I, I, I mean, I got my, I have my opinions on this. Yeah. Of who, if there was one bill we could pick, each of us. Yeah. Not at the same time, but on different days. Mm-hmm. One bill we could put in the drive, and one bill that the subs want us to try to get mm-hmm. in the car. Okay. Now be be mindful. As he's referenced many times, it's a Kia. I don't know if Star's <laughs> sitting back here. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if Jordan Phillips is sitting in the back here. I'm not sure. Ty Nasecki is not getting in this car. <laughs> All right? If you like what you see so far, hit that bell for more. You don't talk like that. I don't. We were looking at the we we're looking at the weight requirement. Like, oh man, we only got room for Hauschka. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a fun discussion to try to say who, because yeah. I know for last year it was it was a slam dunk for you. It was AJ McCarron. Oh yeah, I, without a doubt it was AJ. McCarron. I don't know if I could sit that close to greatness. You said. <laughs> I was uh, serious. I know. I know you were. That's why I laughed. I wasn't joking around. <laughs> I was dead serious. It, it, it's a very intriguing question though. Like if yeah. you. I mean, this year now. You yeah. look at the roster. They're at nine. You got a, be- you got yeah, a bunch to pick yeah, from. Yeah, a bunch of, bunch of guys. Um, hmm. There's a bunch of guys to guy. pick from. Who's the guy that you would pick that you would want to have a drive with for 15 minutes to t- talk with football with or Only 15 it? minutes? Well, that's really what their episodes are. I mean, they're only about 15, 20 minutes, 30 minutes long. <laughs> what I would have said, it going back and knowing what I know now, instead of saying A.J. McCarron, I should have said Ramon Humber. So that we could drive into Montana and leave them there. That's what I should have said. Oh, my God. But if we've only got 15 minutes, Ramon Humber's not on this team anymore. I don't know if you could spend 17 hours in a car with Ramon Humber. Oh, we wouldn't be talking about football. That's for sure. Can you leave? The guy's gone. Can you stop beating him up? dead. Yeah. Right. Come on. I'm not walking over his grave. Well, I mean, he's not here anymore. Upper. 15 minutes with... It's so intriguing with her. Well, I mean, a lot of people are going to see Josh Allen, right? Because he yeah. seems like a good kid. And that wouldn't be a hateful Oh, no, decision. that would be fun. I think I think we'd have a lot of fun with Josh I'd Allen. love to have a throw-off with Josh. Of course you would. Of course I would. God. That video's coming soon, by the way. Of course you would. What? You versus me? Yeah, that's happening. What? Oh, I'll, I'll go to the radar gun with you. With the baseball versus the football? Well, I think football's going to travel a lot slower. You want to bet? <laughs> oh, are you serious? Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. That's fine. That's think, fine. I don't think you realize the gravity of the situation. Oh, God. No, I'd love to have a throw off of that. Just to be, I think it'd be fun. I think it'd be right. very fun. All right. Um, yeah, Alan would definitely be an obvious one. Uh, yeah. I think any really popular player that you have. I mm-hmm. think last year, Kyle would have been phenomenal. Sure. Uh, a couple years ago, Eric Wood. Yeah. I think would have been great. But yeah. that, no, we're transitioning it into now. Oh, God. If there was a player that I could put in the drive, I, I, I'm partial. Mm-hmm. Because my name ends in a vowel. Uh-huh. I'd probably put Milano back there. Really? I'd like to talk with Milano. Okay. Um, a close second would probably be Poyer. Just in, okay. In, in case he might bring his wife. Oh, stop it. <laughs> I saw the grin. I knew it was coming. I would put Milano in the back. Um, I mean, that's if Allen's not available. But Allen would be my first choice. That's See, not, I'd put Milano back I, there. I would go defense, too. I wouldn't go offense. Who would you put? I would put Micah Hyde back there. Oh, that'd be great. Yeah, because he I'd sees everything. To, I'd love to talk to Hyde, just about just about the whole, just about the process. What does that actually mean, right? Because again, he's back there, he's deep, so he does see everything, mm-hmm. right? Um, so I I would love to talk to Micah Hyde about about football life in Buffalo. You know, he seems like a real cool dude. I'd love to talk to Micah Hyde about football um, and what it's like, because I mean. We're talking about a guy who came in from Green Bay broken. Like, yeah. They were, they were well, they tried really, putting him in the slot. Real, there were real concerns about his career when he came over from Green Bay. Well, he was a high draft pick. Yeah. He, he went there. They tried putting him in the slot. It was almost like the 
but when the Bills tried to put Aaron Williams at corner, he yeah. was a natural safety. Yeah, and uh, it was it was burn city for him. He exactly, was torch. Right exactly. There. Now, does that say that Hyde does not play the slot every once in a while? Yeah, he does play. He does. You can't tell him to play that consistently, though. I think. I think every once in a while he does well. Yeah. And because now he's playing his safety, he's playing safety. It's a natural position for him. He sees everything, which means that he's able to read routes a little bit better. Right. So, therefore, when he comes up in the slot to have to play it, he's a little bit better doing it. Well, it's a bit more that. situational. Too, yes, yes, you know? yes. So, I, I think that makes it, it makes the opportunity for him to be successful greater now than it was when he was in Green Bay. I'm surprised you didn't say Zay. No. You love Zay Jones. Zoe would be another guy I'd want in. Zoe? Zoe would be a great. I think he, he would have fun. He would have so much like those other guys. If we put Hyde or Milano back there, yeah. they would be kind of like this is kind of weird. Yeah. But Zoe would just be like, "Hey man, you, you got any wings up there or something?" Yeah, you know? yeah. I I think Zoe would get would get what we do a little bit quicker than a lot of the other players. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that that is I, there anybody you'd not want to have? Yeah, <laughs> there is. It's not live. I, mean, I, I know. It. Yeah, there is. Who would you not want to have in the game? I would not be. I could not be held responsible for the things that I would say to Deion Dawkins. <laughs> I would not be. You able, know he could kill you from the back seat. I'm well aware. <laughs> However, it would be, it would be a very difficult situation for me to be able to contain myself for that long without saying something just a little snarky. I would say something snarky. I would. It's just. It's bound to happen. That's it, what it's what would happen. Yeah. Listen, we couldn't put you in the car with Barkley. Why? Why wouldn't I? Why couldn't I get in the car with Barkley? I'm just saying. You Matt Barkley. Yeah. Because I, I don't know if I could golf with Charles, but I could be in a car with Matt. No, <laughs> you can't. You can't. You can't be in a car with Matt Barkley. Why? Because you also wouldn't be able to contain yourself from washed up quarterback comments for that long. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand. He's not watching. He's in the NFL as a backup. Yeah, I know, but the track. Look, look at his history. He went to USC. You already don't love that. I don't care that he went to you. You're the one that doesn't like USC quarterbacks. You think they're statues? Prove me wrong. That's prove me wrong. I, I'll wait. You know what? I no. I would say the one player. If we were, if we were just, no, just just say this, if we were discounting everything, mm-hmm. okay. The one guy, if I had to pick from the Bills organization, right? Dave, I, I would put uh, I would put Bean back there because I'd love to just talk with Bean for like twenty minutes about like salary cap, how certain things work. See, and I would I would go a bit more stealthy. You take who Dorsey? Or no, no, Lock no. or Hinky? No, 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 I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Because those those be the two guys that I I would really talk to a lot. Right. I mean, advanced I mean, statistics. It's not. Well, that's the thing, right? I think I much with the things with head coaches and general managers, they get a lot of credit for things that they don't necessarily do all the time. Okay. Right. All right. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. I think there's other Bills staffers that I would rather talk to. One Bills coaching staff member that I would put in the back seat, Mark Lubbock. The quality, that, con- the offensive quality control guy. That is stealthy. Put him right, put him right there. That is stealthy. That's, but that's what I mean. That's he's so great. He's responsible for so much, and he's not. People don't normally talk to him, right? Yeah. So you probably can spin that wheel a little bit because he's not used to people go- wanting to talk to him. He you could walk by probably, Mark Lubbock and Tops, and nobody would know the difference. He could be head to toe Bills gear. People are like go Bills. He's like, yeah, that's my job. <laughs> <laughs> You, like, no, you don't work for the Bills. Shut up. Yeah, right. yeah I do. Yeah. Like, I've been there five years. <laughs> <laughs> right. Hey, but that's what I mean is that, like, there's a guy who – we rave about quality control Yes. Uh, for the Bills. And he's part of, of the reason that they're so good at quality control. I would love to have him. That would be great. Yeah, that would be an awesome football conversation to have. Right? That Just talk X's and O's with a guy in quality control. That would be awesome. That would be – That would be awesome. To your point earlier, you know who you couldn't put back there, and I wouldn't be able to control myself. Brian Dable. Brian Dable. Yeah, no, couldn't do it. Mike Dry him pinned to Montana. Leave. <laughs> it's so funny. Dawkins and Dable. 
Yeah. You just don't let, Can't do it. Or Dave's, you know, as Alan calls them. Yeah, it's Dave's. Good old yeah, Dave's. Good old Dave's. No, the problem is, is that I've talked so much trash about them for so long. You can't get off that train now. No, it's it. I'm committed. Like, he could be a all-pro this year. Yep. And Dave could have the second offense in the league. You'd still. No, I, I'm committed. I'm on that train. I'm riding that train. I'm still. That's yeah. where it is. I have to stick with it. It's because okay. there's. I'm a man of principle. You're not. I'm not going to be Stephen A. Smith. You're a far better man than I. Just making stuff up every five minutes. Oh, yeah. You're a far better man than I. Yeah. No, it's. I'm. I've committed to that train. I'm going to ride that train. And I'll admit when I'm wrong. You know. But it's going to be when it's over. That's but, when I'll admit that I'm wrong. <laughs>